He was the only Australian held at the U.S. military prison at Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. He is a confessed Al-Qaeda supporter. And now David Hicks is back on Australian soil. He's very, very glad to be back. Um, he visibly uh, uh, was elated when we touched down at Edinburgh. And uh, um, he'll be very glad to see his family uh, when he is able to over the next few days. Hicks, seen here in this photo provided by his family, was transferred to a maximum security prison in his hometown, where he'll serve seven more months of his sentence. All he wants to do now is to become a regular prisoner, serve his time, and uh, proposes to make every use that he can of the rehabilitation processes here. He wants to get on with his education. He wants to complete high school and, if possible, go into university. Hicks had spent more than five years at Guantanamo and was the first of hundreds being detained there to face a U.S. military tribunal. He was captured by the U.S.-backed Northern Alliance in Afghanistan in 2001 and pleaded guilty in March to providing support to al-Qaeda. Camille Bohannon, The Associated Press.